Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. My name is Teresa and I'm really glad you guys decided to join me today. Today I'm going to be sharing with you a plan with me in my PP weeks for the week of January 25th through the 31st. And I'm going to be using this beautiful kit from Tilly B Plans. It is her two-page PP weeks kit. And here are our full boxes. We've got some half boxes here, some quarter boxes, check checklists, um, a habit tracker, some page flags, our date covers, date dots, bottom washi, weekend banners, some little um, deco fun deco like bow clips. We've got some little arrows here, some more page flags. Are those like full flags? Oh yeah. Okay. Um, a Monday through Sunday sidebar, some today headers, and then it also comes with the glitter headers, which I thought was awesome. So um, I went ahead and put down my date dots, and I pulled out these clips from Run With Craft Scissors. This is her mini... Um, mini bunny butt <laughs> palm on a gold clip, and then this little blue... Um, two-tone blue glitter chevron mini bubble bow on a gold clip. I thought both would look good with these. So that's what I've pulled out. So let's get started. What's the matter, Mia? My dog is like trying to climb up in my chair, which is odd. All right, so let's go ahead and start putting our date covers down. So I hope you guys had a great week last week. I am actually filming this on Tuesday night. Um, I got a little behind on my filming this week, which I talked about in my Erin Condren plan with me. That was went up Monday. So if you didn't miss, didn't see that, go check it out in my. Um, Penny Pages A5 Wide Vertical it went up on Wednesday. You guys are seeing this Thursday. And I am actually going to be in Indiana. I'm heading down Wednesday night and we'll come home Thursday evening. Well, early evening. I don't want to have to drive in the dark. So... <laughs> My goal is to leave by four-ish. Unless it's snowing, then I will either leave earlier or just stay. So I do not do well driving in snow. I, I have like panic attacks, which is so weird had them for probably about 10 years now. I never used to be afraid to drive in a car in the snow and then I don't know what the heck happened but Kristen's the same way. Full-blown panic attacks which isn't good when you're driving. <laughs> That's when you know you become the danger. <laughs> So if you guys are new to my channel, welcome. I'm glad that you are here. I use this planner for my health and wellness. So I track, like, I have chronic pain. I also have a heart condition. I actually had a, I had open heart surgery a month after I turned 38. Um, they found I had a um, a bicuspid aortic valve. So instead of having three leafs in my valve, I only had two, which obviously I was born with that, but no one ever found it until I until three days after my 38th birthday. And 
I mean, I'd had, I'd had issues for many years with my heart, like racing and like, I, it literally would feel like somebody was sitting on my chest, like to the point so I couldn't breathe, whether I was laying down, sitting up, standing, <coughs> and they could never find anything wrong when they would do, you know, like echoes or, you know, echocardiograms where they do an ultrasound of your heart chambers. And I don't know what happened, but <laughs> something did. <laughs> because they found it. Um, when it was really, really bad. Like they said, had they not found it when they did, I wouldn't have lived through the year. Because the pressures in my heart were so bad. Like all of both cardiologists and the, um, the, um, cardio thoracic surgeon or whatever they're called my cardiac my cardiac surgery surgeon they all said the pressures in my heart were literally unchartable they'd never seen them that high in anybody and I was they all said they didn't know how I was alive let alone functioning and so it was they found my valve issue and within a month I was having open heart surgery. I have a mechanical aortic valve so I have a like a titanium or whatever valve in there because I was so young they didn't put a cow or pig valve like they would an older person because obviously they want this to last a lifetime for me. And like a cow or pig valve would need to be replaced within like 10 or 20, 10 or 15 years, I think. So that is that but because I have that valve I do have to take um, Coumadin every day and let me put this down I'm going to put or my weekly tracker in here first. So I have to like check my blood every week. My it's called INR, which is how fast or slow your blood coagulates. And I use a little machine that looks just like a um, just like a glucometer. So like somebody that's diabetic. And it's pretty cool. And I just prick my finger. And put it in my little machine thingy. Put it in the little test strips. And... Then that's that. <laughs> I call my cardiologist report it and I, like I have um, a ratio that I have to stay between which is like a 2.0 to 3.0 and if it's like 
lower than a 2.0, it's too thick, which means it could clot around my valve, which would not be good. <laughs> and then if it's too thin, so if it's over three, um, it's too thin, and then I could run the risk of bleeding to death. <laughs> So then I get to eat extra green veggies like broccoli or Brussels sprouts or spinach. All the things I love that I can't eat very often. I'm going to use, ooh, do I want to use the winter or I'm going to use the let it snow because it's really snowing this week here. So. going to overlap that header just a bit but I'm okay with that oh I love that okay so what this is is it's a box extender and it's from pink polka dot lily and I do PR for pink polka dot lily and you can find my link and discount code down below in my link tree and Oh, no, I don't want to do that. And um, for my discount code, you can find all the shops I PR for down below in my link tree in the description box. Let's put this habit tracker. So what I track is meds, sleep, and then I also, so this sheet is all done. There was four vertical boxes, but I've got another one. And I also have a sheet with for, um, horizontal. Um, all right, so let's, let's move over here. So let's put some full boxes. So let's put the winter on Sunday. So I track my sleep, pain levels, and if it's, it, if it's my back or my chest, like where I had my surgery, I do get a lot of pain there. Um, Monday. So we've got that one. Let's skip Monday and do Tuesday. Let's do this one because we've got one bear here. So, and then I do my meds and washing my face that's what my weekly trackers are for and then um my daily i do my meals because i am on weight watchers so i do my meals all right so then let's use Let's do the little mittens for Monday. Okay. And then let's do the stars for Wednesday. And I also track my weather daily. And I need 
to start tracking my moods, which um, I think, I mean, I used to track that weekly, but I can do that. These are the little polar bears like this, but I'm not going to use that one, so I'm just going to use this one. Okay, so now, let's see, do we have... Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, perfect. But I want to take that... So on the full boxes, I'm just going to do three, the three checklist like that. And then I don't care if it hangs down a little bit. That doesn't bother me at all. But when it was on the full boxes, it hang, hung a little too, too low. Oh, wait. Whoops. Whoops. bad thing about having long nails is you can't really pull stuff up. <laughs> I 
There we go. There, okay. My goodness. Sometimes I just make things for myself way too complicated. <laughs> Does anybody else have that issue? I am really loving her kits for this. Yeah, I am just loving these kits, loving her kits for this. I love her regular kits for the vertical planners too, but I really like this. Okay, so then let's go ahead and put our weekend banner. Drop it down a bit. How cute is that? Okay. So then... Let's see. I have... My regular... My day by day. I mean, it'll be in here anyway, so. All right, so let's go ahead. And these are from Cheerful Planner Girl. Let me just. 
just fill here. I'm turning around, guys. Sorry. And then what I'll do is I'll hold this down with my mental health little clip from Savannah Paper Co. All right. And then, so that's done. Then I need my wash face. I think we should do. Actually, you know what? I'm going to use this one. Because it goes much better. Yeah, and we've got the blue here, or purple. So we're going to drop this one down here. like that and these are the custom habit trackers from cheerful planner girl as well okay then to um monday we did inr so let's grab a little tweezers and these are from beyond paper flowers um let's do the teal here yeah cute there and then I have the custom script from pink polka dot lily and again I do PR for pink polka dot lily and this is the non-foiled it just says check INR and you can get these in foil or non-foiled she has 35 foiled colors to choose from guys in the shop which is amazing then I had a doctor's a virtual visit Day. So let's just put, and this is from the planner's world. This is Nurse Mona, and I do PR for Sue as well. All right, so then let's take this and go. These are the um, custom itty bitty script from Cheerful Planner Girl. She has amazing customs in her shop, so I have a ton of customs from her. Let's do an Avery Medicine from Creative Cavern Studios here. Um, and then this is going to be my sleep tracker. So let's put our custom itty bitty script that says sleep. We'll put from Cheerful Planner Girl. And then we're going to use, we'll use this little sleep mask right there again from cheerful planner girl and then on this header we're going to put the small self-care script from uh, craft penguin planner okay Friday is also way in, so let's use, let's use this purple one right here. These are from Creative Cavern Studio, but like I said, she only has um, the character stickers in the shop. And that 
my friends is that so then if I need anything else I can use these quarter boxes I do track my weather so I put little weather icons here whether it's snowing or just cold or whatever so let's put our clips on and we're gonna call it good so I hope that you guys enjoyed this plan with me if you did please give me a big thumbs up if you're new to my channel make sure you hit that red subscribe that's down below and don't forget to hit the little bell and when you get the drop down menu select all and you'll be notified every time I upload a new video and please leave any comments questions or suggestions down below in the comments because I love to hear from each and every one of you and as always from me to you great big hugs happy planning have a wonderful week and I will see you guys in my next video bye guys